All right, hey everybody, uh, playing first match of the Seaside Mix Tournament um, with Rainbow Chalice, and uh, so this is again probably uh, something you can figure out if you've watched any of the other mix videos, but a uh, selection of 75 cards curated by Donald X involving the themes um, and featuring cards from the expansion Seaside. Um, let me look at the board. Um, Captain is a really good card. This pageant. Yeah, you can get a you can get a captain somewhat quickly here by giving pageant pot potentially. Um and there's plenty of good stuff for it to be here. Mm, any of the trashing cards are nice. <coughs> I'm kind of thinking pageant amulet. Um, I guess maximal like captain chances is like pageant courtyard. Gaining two coffers. I don't know that that's um, you know, particularly worthwhile, but anyway, that would be the the angle if you really were trying for the the captain first. I think Swamp Hag probably isn't going to be very good here. I think there's enough trashing and alternative gaining and stuff. Um, Of course, there's ways to get um, your lamp faster. Um, I'm going to try the uh, basically the Rush Captain strat, for lack of a better word. Yeah, Secret Cave also does it. So we'll see how this all goes. I'm really not opening with a treasure is pretty weird. We've both done that actually. Um, <coughs> so my courier misses, which is pretty unfortunate for me, but not much I can do now. He's got enough for a captain if he wants one, and also coffers. Um. He takes a gold, which is not good. Um. I, d I mean, my opening was probably pretty bad, but... <coughs> And he's gaining silvers, which is also not the greatest compared with trashing, probably. But, you know, we'll just see how it all goes. Um... I could, um, I guess I can just get another Captain may miss here, which would be unfortunate. Um, yeah. <coughs> my play has been kind of sloppy, I think. I think my draws have been bad, but... Not great choices either. Anyway. Um...
probably will get to his lamp here. So he should win this game pretty easily, um, assuming he takes captains with him. But even if he doesn't, probably he's pretty safe to win here. Um, now, if I... So I do have... I have five cards in play. I don't have another. Potentially, village here can get me. See, nothing else would get me an activation, but village at least has some potential. It doesn't get me there, and it's not like the. Mm, it's not like the best. <coughs> um. doesn't give me like the best odds of activating but he can just buy provinces honestly and he'll just outscore me but anyway he didn't so um here I have to think I know there's a courtyard on top I guess it's still Probably better to play the courtyard first here. Um, okay. So no activation. And no good chance of it for the next turn. <coughs> he could be up three provinces before I even activate. I just am, uh, this is bad. I'm going to need. I'm going to need to get so many duchies, which means develop, but it's just going to be hard. There aren't really the gains for it. <coughs> um, I mean, all my wishes can be duchies, I guess. He's just, he's just going to crush me. Okay. Okay, this is something. <coughs> now what it is is not clear. One, two. Well, I'm going to have to play this stuff anyway, so. Okay. I really need to buy a province here, so it doesn't really make sense for me to discard.
There's his wishes. Man, I have to get so many duchies over the next couple turns. Um... I mean, I can just do all the wishes for duchies if I really want to, but I also have to somehow have eight dollars still. doesn't seem like all that nice right now. It could be, but um so the watchtower is only two. Doesn't really help me. He has to miss province somewhere along the line for me to even have a shot, but I don't even remember what my last cards are. There's a courtyard and an amulet, I guess. I don't even have a develop, which I need. That's so bad. Um. He's at three duchies. Five I can still potentially come back from if I have the develops. But it's hard. Um. It's so hard. This is so bad. <laughs> so in the end, none of the wishes went to duchies. So, yeah, he's not going to miss province. So I can't buy province anymore. This has got to be like triple duchy. 
somehow. Um, okay, well, I guess I'm not going to discard any of those. Take this. I don't know if a silver gain helps me at all. The silver probably doesn't help me. Some of this stuff, I really would have preferred to have the, uh, the secret cave money on the next turn. Probably two coffers will be enough if I get, um, what I'm trying to do. Yeah, I can't even triple devote. I mean, there's no way. <laughs> this is real bad. Maybe I need an estate even. He has, uh, he's going to have 32. I'm going to have 19. Potentially 20. Double duchy province would then do it. Not that I can do that. I guess I can clear off the the top here. Whether that's worth it, I'm not sure. <coughs> okay. We need to place some of these as blessed villages just because that we have the courtyards in the deck but we need the I mean what do I have as far as treasure I just have the four coppers I mean my develop on Blessed Village could potentially give me a silver. Okay. Um. <coughs> it's 
such a pain. That should come later, right? I did just go second, so I would take a tie for sure. <laughs> um, I guess I don't need this many actions, most likely. Okay. Yeah, this is already failure. Basically, um, I don't even know what I have. Like, I just don't have the the stuff at all. I can wait. I mean, I can try and wait another turn, but he's got a province. But I like for sure don't have the the gains now. Or the money. I could have trashed more as I went along. Yeah, I just am not trashed or anything. He'll just buy it. That was so bad by me. This whole game has been a nightmare. was so bad. All right, he went first. Okay. I can top deck a cargo ship, that's okay. Um you're not trashing. Otherwise you would probably go for a um <coughs> probably you would go for a uh what am I trying to say? A uh tactician, double tack deck. Uh, without the trashing, I don't know that it's as compelling. Um, so we can top deck cargo ship and probably buy 
Well, you don't know what you're going to buy. Either a silver or like an armory, I guess. <coughs> the silver is not that compelling. Uh, the armory is much better, I guess, as getting to do the top decking with. The cargo ship itself is quite good. We'll just try it. I don't know. All right, we hit the armory, so that's nice. <coughs> um, yeah, I mean, you're going to try and get a lot of rangers here. It would be a little hard, though, to actually draw the deck. Or it will be quite hard, to be honest, to draw the deck consistently. Um, but you can do it for a little bit. You want to be gaining like other good stuff as you go along so that you're not just like... I guess you can probably set up your turns to some degree. Um, which should be nice. With Secret Passage is what I meant. If you if they literally let you get like everything, which maybe they will. Um, I don't know when when you take the flag bear exactly. I guess I'll just try it. Question is whether I want a night watchman here or not. Um, I'm gonna go with the silver. He can, of course, counter with another flag bearer. It would be nicer if there was something you could use to get rid of flag bearers, but. He just buys an armory, okay. So I at least get it for a turn. Um. Yeah, I'm probably thinking way too ambitious with this idea of deck drawing. You're probably going to be next to impossible to actually do. Even if you had 10 rangers. So given that, that's probably a pipe dream. What would a nice alternative look like? I think if there's a regular village here, <coughs> but I'm really not certain. I don't know. I feel like drawing cards, though. I think it's probably pretty bad. He gets a ranger. I guess I'll take a night watchman. I don't even know if I want the flag bearer, right? It's not that great. We know that we've got to, uh, well, the advantage, well, I'm going to trigger anyway unless I do two. I've got armory and cargo ship down in here, so I can get villa, play all of them. So I should probably just do three. Not clear to me. <coughs> okay, 
asking you to go on. It was a little weird with all the gain, to be honest. Um, He just let me hold this flag. Maybe I should have gone ahead and gotten uh, another thing set aside. Um, I mean, I can top deck a couple. I don't have. I guess if I buy Villa, I can get three fours, so that's okay. I think for the most part the decks just aren't going to be that great. I've kind of gone for it, but it's not going to be that good. I wouldn't expect anyway. <coughs> That's real weird. The estate, of course, is very, very strange. Let me get a second cargo ship here. Kind of like them. Assume he'll buy a villa. He buys another villa. That's a little odd to me, but whatever. This deck's going to end up being terrible. My deck is just going to be awful for sure. Um... Um, I may just buy the rest of the villas just to have um, them gone. I probably probably should have saved this secret passage, right? I could have got a I could have bought and drawn a, a ranger. That was really bad, actually, to not do that. Um, That was really, really stupid of me. But what can you expect? Um. 
So essentially here, I have um, we're buying these flybirds like one shot at getting a villa. Yeah, that kind of works. Um, what should be on top? I mean, I don't really want to play any of these things that badly. Whatever. That was sort of weird play by me. Um. I guess I'll keep all of those. I still like my deck better than his deck, but it's going to be a little bit of a crapshoot. We are like we're like over terminal and uh, I would say is the main issue. <coughs> his estate's so weird. I gotta think about gaining a ranger on top here just to get the the plan. Then I'll probably start draining. I mean, we're gonna run. We could run piles anyway. This bottom deck here may be totally dead. Okay. So one secret passage is worth of searching to see what we can do. Oh, he bid 16. Yeah, he doesn't have that much money, so. Or he bid 15. He can have it for 15. You shouldn't, he shouldn't do this, this using the coffer and pay debt. You should just wait until you're gonna fully um, pay it off but it's fine with me if he wants to do that Here we're able to draw a little bit. I can just stop, I can put a ranger on top. And buy another province. I'm actually a bit. I don't really remember what I have left in deck, <laughs> to be honest. Um,
I did get six villains. That's good to know. What you would ideally want to do is secret passage all your bad cards to the exact spot where you're gonna stop drawing and then night watchman them, because you know you're not you're not gonna draw a deck, right? So you're gonna. Um, you know you have some. Uh, I guess you can probably do that now, sort of. You can always just bottom deck them too, of course, which may be the the safer thing in general here. Um, so. I can top deck a villa. Which will be alright. Most probably. Let's do that. Um, and then play these. We don't want to, <laughs> it would be really nice to actually get uh, far enough here so that the bottom of the deck isn't complete garbage. I don't know if there's another ranger in here or not. You can get one. Um... Because otherwise the bottom here is really bad. I guess if we got close enough to it, we could think about a curse pile out somewhere. Or an estate pile out. I don't think we're going to have the money quite for that ever. But um, Yeah, there were a bunch of rangers down there. So this didn't really help us all that much. Actually, that was probably a really bad order to do stuff in. Um, I can do four estates. I mean, he's probably not going to beat that. I just don't know if I can end it really in time. This was just a lucky draw for me. To even get this together. Although I probably will end up just top decking a ranger and playing Villa Ranger. Okay, the armories are lowering. I'm fine with. I'm totally fine with just like buying an armory or buying a flag bearer too if that's what my turn's going to be. Um, yeah. I um, don't mind lowering estates for this shuffle. Okay. This deck is terrible. He would be way better off just like doing money kind of thing. <coughs> With some cargo ships. Something like that. Pretty sure. It's a real mess what I've built. 
despite him having, the, I mean, I did get my line share of the pieces, so I can actually make it kind of run, but. My Night Watchman is pretty funny for how much garbage I still have. It wasn't really, didn't get to toss much. I had some other ones that were pretty good, but. Um, yeah, here I'll probably just lower the estates as much as I can. Seems like likely to be the, the thing. Um, like three estates is going to be pretty hard to catch up over a couple turns or however many. Like this is finish in hand for me, so he can't score very much in his one turn. He may be able to get his first province, but well, I'm sure he'll be able to do that. But oh, a mess! It was a mess! It was a mess! That was weird. That was really weird bias. Those are like, that was like the strangest. I don't have any idea what that is on about, to be honest. Or the, du the double duchy, I guess, is what I mean. Well, the estate's weird too, but. Um, but double duchy instead of province is, is super weird. Okay. Um, definitely don't, I don't believe in what I did on that board particularly at all. But he kind of did something similar but worse. I mean, he was second player in fighting for limited resources, so I'm not saying he, like, blew it by choices, but the the decks were not good, and it was not, it was a really bad deck to have the worst version of, like, it wasn't good to have the good version of it and to have the bad, the worst version of it was not, was a really hard position to be in. Um, Captain has count them zero targets on this board um, so there's that <laughs> um, and there's no village otherwise you would you know you'd be able to you know if we had blessed village or I don't know what the other villages are on the set maybe bazaar you could do a uh, bridge troll deck, even though it might be a little slow, but you would do it with, with ghost ships. Um, so the question here is whether you want to try and make the... What's City Gate do? I don't think I'm going to open City Gate. Um, so whether you want to try to do double tack? Probably not. The trashing were better. You might do that with the mystics, but um, as it is, I just don't think it's gonna cut it. it. Would be nice to have the silver on the next turn. Maybe get a big cemetery or something. But 
this is okay too. I mean, really here, you're pretty limited. on what exactly you can do. I would say, you know, you can get some archives. And a ghost ship or whatever. But he gets a jester. Jester's, jester could be quite nice here too. Um, nothing against a jester here. It can be pretty mediocre as well, but with good hits, it could be quite quite nice. He gets a tactician. Now, tactician, uh, tactician doesn't inspire me quite so much. I wouldn't say. Um, Maybe it's nice against ghost ships. I don't know. So. What does innovation do? Innovation could be okay. I mean, usually innovation is really good. But here, the, if we had some cheap cards to gain with replace, that would help it a lot. Could be a nice adjuster. I'm trying to think if I can fit a ghost ship in here. Well, certainly I can fit it in the deck as it currently exists. It's not going to get in the way of much. Um, it's maybe not as good given that he has tactician. Like, I don't know. You know, he can he can play a tactician. It doesn't hurt the turn he has a tactician down, and then it doesn't hurt. Um, Uh, I guess I could consider a city gate too. If I think silver is not the the thing, but I think silvers are probably okay. Um, maybe the ghost ship isn't so good given that he has the tactician. I would love it if his ghost hits a tactician at some point. <laughs> that would be so funny. may have the tack in hand, so this could be a cemetery. A pretty nice cemetery. I guess I could have um, thought about Haunted Mirror. I'm going to need I'm going to need a replace. If he has tactician in hand then this the ghost ship was really not not really doing that much. I mean, by innovation, if I can, yeah, like there, the, the, really wasn't, uh, that powerful of a, of a thing. Um, now here it may help, depending.
is a strange board. I don't really think I'm playing it all that well. But. He gets innovation. Um, I guess I'll take the research. Uh, there are some draws here where I don't hit the innovation by, but it was not super likely, so... Hopefully he doesn't have tactician in hand. I guess he also has his little city gate thing to help him um help him find that kind of stuff. I should get City Gate just for the mystic aspect. Um, it's like a it's like a guaranteed. Oh, that's so funny. <laughs> um, so he does the. Uh, I guess I should get a ghost. Well, I didn't do that. Well, I can still, right? Depending on what I draw, or if I draw um, my ar ghost ship or whatever. If I have the ghost ship on top. Yeah, I wasn't thinking there. Um, I forget, I forgot kind of how ghost work. So that wasn't the best ever. I could get a city gate now. Um, whether that's better than just getting a... I wonder if... I guess with research... No, you can't time it. Um... How did I know? Okay. I could get a tactician. That'd be kind of funny. I guess I'm actually thin enough that that maybe makes sense for me. just have to kind of be a little careful with your ghost. But. Mm. Him gaining silvers isn't too scary. Well, it's probably like the best outcome. Maybe. I'm not sure. He gets another tactician, which I don't think is that good. Does he know that that won't do anything? I feel like I should, I feel like I should tell him. <laughs> And and to help him. But um
I guess this doesn't matter. I should have done the cemetery. That was sort of weird, but. Probably that could have been played much better. I should have told him when he did this thing. I didn't know he had a ghost ship. Okay, so I put cemetery and then silver. Okay. Um, this can probably just be a tactician by though I should try and find something better but like I don't have like a specific wish that's like clearly better I mean ghost ship would be fine but in like archive would have worked too and replace would have worked um Should I research one of these silvers or the cemetery or something? I feel like they're like replace targets that I shouldn't just toss. Like if I had a copper, I'd kill it, but. I didn't also check my shuffle. I don't know when I shuffled. Maybe the Certain cards were impossible to find, probably. This won't matter. Because I'm going to have the... The tactician. Okay. Um... How much money do I want to have? Realistically. If I want to trash these coppers, I got to have a cemetery game to do it. Or just play the research one by one. Mm -hmm. I don't know what's left. There's like a silver and some other thing. Oh, the ghost. I forgot the ghost. I guess it doesn't really matter. How do I type go ghost? Oh, I can't even click on the thing that says ghost over there. That's stupid. <laughs> um, oh, I can't play the ghost either in double tactician. Man, that's even dumber. I'm not... I don't know if I've really thought through the implications of this deck I'm trying to build here. I guess I should say I clearly haven't thought through the implications of the deck I'm trying to build here. Um... I guess I'll take the research. Uh, okay. Copper. It was a copper. I don't 
don't know. Cemetery. Okay. It's a cemetery. Man, like, what am I doing? Mystic silver. Oh, it was a silver. I don't know what else I have. More mystics. Oh, it's a copper. So what am I doing? I also just keep, like, trashing silvers over the cemetery that I'm just holding for whatever reason. I don't know why I keep doing that. Pretty silly of me. I guess I'm going to start. Is research you may or not? No, it's you must. Uh, I guess I'm going to draw through these so it's not super important. I guess it's never that important. I just have to like pay attention to which one. I did forget about the jester. But it's not, I don't know, it's not a really big deal either direction. As l since I, it's just good that I didn't put like Mystic or Ghost Ship on top of there. Um, is the main thing, I would say. I'll be right back. I'll take my turn and then I'll be right back. Oh, he did tactician again. That's sad. Um, I guess I can guarantee my draw by... Well, it doesn't matter what order I do this in. I can still guarantee my draw. How did I know? Um, okay. I don't have eight mystics yet, so I can't... Double province, just yet, yeah, just completely freely. Um, but I should. This should do it now. Um, I don't know. There's like a ghost in there, and something else. I wish for the ghost. Nope, it was a mystic. Oh, there's another mystic. Now I think it's a ghost. Uh, now I should try and find the research, which I guess is the only card, so. Um, well, the ghost is a reasonable target to turn into a thing later. Oh, he had researched last turn. Okay. That makes sense. Oh, 
Okay, so there's. A, I'm looking for a replace. And then there's a few mystics. Um. I don't know if I can play this. I don't think I can play the archive because then I think I don't have enough to double. I mean, I don't have to double, but um, it'll only give me 12. Okay. Um, I don't think this matters now. I'm just guaranteed to draw it. That wasn't especially nice. I should have played the archive, actually. I should have not wished it and played the archive, but... Anyway, this is fine. And I can just finish it next turn. That was really... I don't know. I think I've been pretty fortunate with his jester hits. I don't think he's really gotten anything that I would say was a bad hit for me against me. I wouldn't say he's gotten any very good hits really. Um Okay. Just need to find the Uh, find the replaces the main thing. I don't really know what's left, but okay. All right, one more. I shouldn't have played the uh, replace. Five two would have been really nice here. Um, this would have been a captain board. So there is some draw and some trashing. Nothing to write home about, though. But you wouldn't want to play against that stuff uncontested. The artisan stuff uncontested. Um, so, what do you open? I'm kind of tempted to do a develop. I don't know if it's all that good. I mean, it'll be good. You can get ghost towns or silvers, water vassals. Um, here I'm thinking about saving and buying courtyard. I'm not sure, to be honest. Summon's really nice here. He buys it in. That's not a very good opening. Um, 
to be perfectly honest. My, uh, oh yeah, that's the save. So I will draw the, the thing. Um, he buys another N. Ends are, you know, whatever. They're not that good. Just in general, <laughs> in my opinion. Uh, I could have possibly summoned there as well. That wouldn't have been out of the question. But I want an artisan, so I got one. Here I'll probably save Ghost Town. I probably won't go for a second artisan, which means the rest of the fives will be summons, or the rest of the buys will be summons of one sort or another, um, most likely. This will probably be a caravan gain on the artisan. He is buying those ends. Um, there's a develop down here, which I, I mean, I guess I could get an in now. Or it can just top deck the the develop. Well, I have five. I think, I think I'm going to do it this way. I don't really know if it's necessarily correct, um, but I'm going to do it this way. I should think about picking up a smugglers. He is gaining like fives and sixes, so I would take the free five and sixes, whatever, just because of the, um, yeah, the, this in stuff is not going to, it's not going anywhere. And then a ghost town there, that makes no, uh, that doesn't make any sense because he's not, um, Well, he's just not. One of these, I guess I should top deck. I wasn't super thrilled with the card he gained, so I could top deck the smugglers. I didn't get a ghost town playing though, so I maybe should have played the smugglers to be honest. Because I'm going to be a little action low here. I mean, he's going to, he has like one terminal and a thousand villages. by the caravan. Uh, I will take the caravan. I guess I keep summoning those. I don't know that that's really the like the best absolute play, but it seems unlikely that it is. I could get a second develop. That wouldn't be crazy. He 
he's just going to discard down to, you know, four coppers again or whatever. Yeah, it's just not. really deck that makes a lot of sense um so here i can get the last caravans and i can i don't know i could get another silver or i could get another develop I don't think this or stuff matters a whole lot. I guess in would help me get to the smugglers better. If I want that. I don't know that I'm well, I'm not terribly likely to get there, apparently. I could get another Smugglers. Um, that's not all that good. Let's just get a Silver. Not the most, I don't know, I'm not playing him real well, but he doesn't, his deck is just wheel spinning. What did he get an artisan? So that's nice for me to smuggle. For sure. Um, I can artisan another. Well, that it's okay for me to smuggle anyway. It's not like the greatest thing. The, the targets are a little bit low at this point. but I guess this just needs to be an in. I don't know. I can get vassals if I want to. I can also just get provinces now and add in inns and courtyards as a way to just filter or to just cycle. I could also just get dungeons and I'd do the same thing probably a little better a little quicker. I think I'll probably just go ahead and start greening now and, you know, being able to save stuff and then continually add things should be good enough. 
or whatever. No need to. No need to work super hard at this point. This is probably not the highest percentage play. Um, but I think it'll probably work. <clears throat> he is getting duchies. We can also empty the duchy. I mean, if there was another pile that was low here, I would go ahead and empty the duchies with him in this adventure. We can get golds. I mean, we can take the duchies off the smugglers and then um, potentially turn those into gold or something. The artisans here are not the best thing in the world. It doesn't hurt too bad to green just because of the I don't know what I just discarded them up. really thinking my best here. That probably should have been a something else. Whatever. I guess I'll save the develop. I don't know. That was all kind of sloppy. The ideal deck here probably is trashed a little more aggressively than I have, but I'm not even sure about that, to be honest. Uh, Smugglers isn't very good this time, so we can get rid of it. Um, depending on, you know, how much work we want to spend here we can uh, try and get the we could get another in I guess it's probably okay can't really save anything this time. That's okay. Main thing is just to play the caravans and the ghost town. Playing the develop is okay too. What did he get a vassal? I mean, that's fine, but. I'm not really sure what I'm aiming for this turn. I've got most everything now. He's just trash it. Crashing a copper is pretty good.
We did not uh, play the ghost town. I mean, I guess I could get it. I don't know what, like, what should I gain that will give me the best chance of finishing soonish. Like another one of these guys, maybe. There was a, I don't know how this will work. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> um. So here I'm pretty likely to dud-ish, sort of dud. I don't know, it's not that duddy, but pretty easy for me to miss province on this turn anyway. I mean, I'm, I'm like essentially, I'm not technically there, but I'm pretty close to like half VP already. Um, I will be after this turn, maybe? Probably if I'm paying better attention here, I could guarantee it or something, but. Um, well, this doesn't matter. I'm going to play this thing. I wish there was like a really fast three pile we could do. I would have angled for that from the beginning. Um,. Probably there was an, there was probably an angle where I could have gotten the lowered the ends and the develops probably pretty fast, but maybe the courtyards. I don't know. Um. Like here, I can't even buy. Like anything, I guess I'm not totally stopped yet, but what did he gain? Silver. I am pretty mad I lost that first game. It was my own fault. But Yeah, you bought a province. I still don't have the money in hand. Okay, now I do. All right. That's the match. Um, so, thanks for watching. See you for the next one. Bye.